Okay, so here we are. This is the transmission problem. I got a 2022 here where you try to crank, nothing happened. You put your foot on the brake pedal, you hit the start stop button. As you can see, the vehicle will not shut off. It doesn't do anything. You can't do, you're stuck. Okay, this is documented in a TSB I'll talk about later. So now I'm gonna show you before your battery goes dead because you can't turn the vehicle off. You hit the brake pedal, you can't, it doesn't do nothing and then the cluster will show eventually if you keep hitting these buttons service transmission you see how it blinks like right there this is the this is the problem with the park paw position that now you are stuck and the only way to do this without tools to disconnect the battery which i don't have with me so i'm stranded now is to pull the fuse that's back here behind all this plastic for the transmission control module so i'm going to show you how to do that later all right, so the first thing you gotta do to get to the transmission control module fuses is you gotta take this guy at the top. You grab this plastic piece. It's kind of hard your first time. Just grab it, yank it right up and off. The problem is you have a bungee cord here. I've already adjusted mine so that the bungee cord can come off. Flip it to the side. The key thing, be very careful. This right here is the speaker wire. You wanna pull up the red tab that locks it down and then you want to Unconnect this before you try yanking this assembly because there's no slack. So, pull the connector off for the speaker first because, as you can see, there's no slack. Because when you yank this guy, it just lets go all the clips at once. You know how it works with interior. There's also a bungee cord here to be careful of. So, you gently so you pull that back. Then, at the bottom, you got to be careful of the wireless Bluetooth charger. So, you got to disconnect that one too. Now you've got this guy loose. Flip this open. you got your fuses. <clears throat> now what you're gonna need to do, you can even look in the cover here. There's two transmission fuses. Uh, location, the one that I've been pulling, I believe is F5, which is a 15 amp TCM fuse. So one, two, three, four, five, this bottom one for me. Problem is, <clears throat> there's nothing here. There's no tool like back in the day to give you to pull these fuses. So the good news is, you got your GM key, right? There's your little pry bar wedge. You come in here with your key and you just pry it until it pops out. And that's how you remove the 15 amp fuse for the TCM. Now if that one doesn't help fully reset your TCM, there is another one which is down here. Same thing, pull that fuse which is a 10 amper, but I've been having luck pulling just this 15 amp. This resets just the transmission. You don't need any tools to remove the battery and you should have everything that you need in order to get that transmission controller reset and back on the road to crank after you put that fuse back in. This is the TSB that I think you can find on the NHTSA website, 23-NA-176. This has to do with the park ball position rod, not returning to the uh, position within the spec. So, this vehicle here will now be uh, getting a new transmission at about 13,000 miles for this particular TSB.